Donald Trump, you're fired. <laughs> and now you are literally not my president. I also have a joke for you, Donald. Donald, knock knock. Who's there? Joe. Joe who? Joe President. You see, Donnie, you lost. And guess what? You, the election wasn't stolen. Oh wait, the election was stolen. Just not the 2020 election. The 2016 election was stolen. Hillary Clinton beat you in the popular vote by three million votes. The system, was, as you said, was rigged in your favor. The only reason you won is because it was rigged. Do you know why you... Because, quite frankly, you suck. See, Donnie, you said you didn't... John McCain was a war hero because he wasn't cap because he was captured, and you that you like people who weren't captured. Well, you're a businessman and you went bankrupt six times. I like businessmen who don't go bankrupt, like Bill Gates or Steve Jobs. You know that sort of thing. Anyway, um, the fact of the matter is is that you yeah you say but Sleepy Joe and all this crap about. Joe Biden having Alzheimer's, but think about it. You got beat by a guy with Alzheimer's. How does that make you feel? The American people still took him over you. And frankly, I'd vote for a cow before I'd vote for you. <laughs> you didn't get that wall built like you promised. Well, I think, like, what was it? What was it? Five miles, ten miles, or something like that? But you did build a wall around the um, White House to keep all the people who were fed up with your bullshit out. And, um, by the way, I hear you're in trouble again in New York. And uh, you're down in Mar-a-Lago in Florida. See, the thing is, is you're such a loser. And you're such a fucking piece of shit. You didn't leave New York. You were kicked out. <laughs> and quite frankly... I can't blame them. Anywho, now that you are out of office, you will most likely go down as the worst president in U.S. history. We have lost more Americans to coronavirus in, a, in less than a year than we lost in all of World War II. And to top it all off, three million jobs are gone. And, uh, because of your mishandling of this situation. Now, I assume you're going to try to blame the state governors on this. And, but you see, you, in, you try to incite the people to rebel. And, what's, and try to make it look like you were on their side. But wait a second. Why were the Social Security offices closed? Hmm? Why were, um, military recruitment offices closed? Those are controlled at the federal level, i.e. by you. Well, they were controlled by you until Biden whooped you in the election. And you say you won the 2016 election in a landslide? Well, guess what? By your own standard, you more than lost this election in a landslide. Because Biden beat you not only in the electoral college, but in the popular vote as well. <laughs> but anyway, Donald, 91% of the people you appointed left office sooner or later because they just didn't want to deal with your insane bullshit. You see, Trump, you have the mentality of an eight-year-old, and you've admitted as such. You said in your book, The Art of the Deal, I am the same person I was at eight years old. And um, the problem is, is that we, in America, do not have a place for a child king such as yourself. You were never, you are nothing more than a failed businessman, and now you are a failed president. You are a failure, Donald. And I know that that's not... I know that you can't grasp that because of how narcissistic you truly are. But granted, you are a winner only in your, nar in your incredibly narcissistic mind and the 
legions of stupid people you have managed to attract. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Be good, y'all.